Hey, hey, hey everyone, Rosbowski here, and welcome back to some more Five Nights at Freddy's 3 Top 10 videos. And today we're going to be talking about the top 10 facts about Springtrap. Springtrap is a fantastic character and new to the brand new game. So let's have a look at some of the interesting story behind him. In at number 10, guys, we have got that Springtrap was found behind a walled off safe room. In the very first night, the foam dude alludes to the fact that a an architect who helped design the original buildings said that there were some hidden rooms that have been uh, sealed off and you might find something inside at the beginning of night two they said they found spring trap which means in one of these hidden safe rooms that is where they found the brand new spring trap i i love that i love that idea because it shows that Scott's really thought about it, and, and why why is Springtrap in the game where the rest of them have already been scrapped or sold off or whatever, especially when you see what the ending is later on. It makes perfect sense for Springtrap to be hidden away, and that is exactly why that's in at number 10. In at number 9, guys, we have got Springtrap is one of the original two suits. So, way, way back at the start, you had a Golden Freddy and you had a Springtrap suit. Now, at this point, Springtrap was referred referred to as another name, which was Spring Bonnie, which we'll go on to later on. But these were the two lead characters right at the start there. The golden hue, the, the way they look amazingly, and we see this in one of the mini games when we get to play as Golden Freddy, or perhaps even Fredbear at this point. We're not really too sure. We need to find out some more information there, but there we go. Springtrap was one of the two original animatronics. In at number eight, guys, we have got the purple man used Springtrap to look the kids to their doom. In the night five phone call, the phone guy sort of hints at the fact that the spring bonnie suit has been moved. Now, when we see the ending at the end of night five, we see the, the safe room and the fact that the purple guy is quite used to using this suit. Originally, we thought that... um. It was Golden Freddy. Golden Freddy was the suit used to lure the children, but Scott threw it on its head. Uh, in, in Night 2, uh, in Five Nights at Freddy's 2, the phone guy said that one of the yellow suits has been used and sort of trails off. We all assumed it was Golden Freddy, but no, the yellow suit that was used was Spring Bonnie, and it's just, oh, he just adds so much more into the game, and that is exactly why that is in number 8. In number 7, guys, we have got Spring Trap is lured by sound. Now, there's a couple of interesting things to do with this. So, the phone guy in one of the conversations uh, says that the animatronics um, are lured by sound because they want to stay where the action is. That's where they're supposed to be. All the children are laughing and giggling and stuff, and uh, that is why they are lured by the sound. But... Could the purple man, when he's in Springtrap, also be lured by the children's laughter? That's why we use Balloon Boy's voice. We use the hi and hello and the giggle. And uh, we uh, trick Springtrap into thinking that we are in another room. Now, who's in control at this point? Is it Springtrap or is it the purple man? It's a very interesting point. But that is why that fact is in there at number seven. In at number six, guys, we have got the dual purpose suit. Springtrap used to be a dual purpose suit when he was way back as a uh, Spring Bonnie. The, at this point in time, the, the suits had two functions. They had the animatronic function and they had the, the costume uh, function that you could wear it. A human could go inside it and wear it. You would use the, the, the crank to lock the endoskeleton in place and you could gently force your way inside spring trap. But... These were very temperamental, and unfortunately, in a sister company, or, well, the, a sister location, the spring locks began to fail, but Springtrap was still used as a dual purpose, and, and the Purple Man unfortunately met his doom. Well, fortunately, unfortunately, either way you want to look at it, the Purple Man died because the, the spring lock mechanism failed in that suit. But that's exactly why the dual purpose suit is in number six. In at number five, guys, we have got Spring Trap was burned, or was he? At the end of night six, when you complete nightmare mode, you get a newspaper saying everything's been burned to the ground, and we assume Spring Trap was involved in this fire. But if we highlight the image, we will see behind the toy freddy we will see what looks to be springtrap now has springtrap survived are we going to be looking at springtrap in another game or is this just him as a corpse just lying there 
I think Springtrap could still be alive, but the fact that Springtrap was involved in this fire is in at number five. In at number four, guys, we have got the secret loadout screen. Oh, Scott is good at hiding in these little mini Easter eggs, but this is literally the best Easter egg loadout screen. Now, Sometimes when you load up the game, you get a small chance of having a, this image pop up in front of you. You have got the the, the spring trap, and he's trying, and the, the purple man is tr looks like he's trying to force the mask off of his face, and he's just revealing his 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 person inside it, and it just looks so grotesque and gruesome, and, and it looks absolutely fantastic, and it kind of moves on to something else. But that is exactly why that is in number four. In number three, guys, we have got spring trap is the original Bonnie. Now, now, we've all seen what the the the, um, the Bonnie we know and love looks like, but this is the original Bonnie. This is the first version of Bonnie that we know of, and it is Spring Bonnie, Golden Bonnie, um, and he looks absolutely fantastic. And that little bit of a fact is in number three. In at number two, guys, we have got Spring Trap's real name is actually Spring Bonnie. Now we learned this name uh, in night five. We've just referred to him as Spring Trap up until now because that's what we know it as thanks to Scott's little teaser but as with Mangle Springtrap is just a nickname the original name for um, Springtrap is Spring Bonnie and that's why that is in a number two in a number one guys the best part of it all the best fact in my opinion is the purple man is inside of Springtrap now at the end of night five you will see um, um, a scene with 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 the, the, the five spirits of the murdered children and you will see the purple man eventually the purple man does his crazy little dance he jumps inside a spring trap he gets all high and mighty thinking he is one because the the animatronics won't harm another animatronic until the spring mechanism fails it fails and so does the purple man's plan to escape and he gets crushed inside of that suit spelling the end of the purple man but not the complete end because as we know, Springtrap is lurking about in this brand new game. But anyway, guys, there we go. There's the top 10 facts about Springtrap. I hope you enjoyed these today. If there's one that I've missed or um, one that you want to tell me is your favorite, then pop that down in the comment section below. I always love reading your comments, and the channel has grown fantastically over the last week, and actually exponentially since the, uh, last week. So thank you very much for that. It really, really is appreciated. Thank you so much. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you enjoyed what you've seen today. And I'll see you soon for some more Five Nights at Freddy's 3 videos and some more horrors. We're going to be introducing some more games to the channel very soon. Either way, guys, I've been Razbowski. You've been the beautiful bastards, as always, for watching. And I love each and every single one of you. Goodbye!